That's right. You get burning, baby. You get burning. All right. So nice treat here. Uh, playing my Godzilla title. Godzilla for PS4. And the first matchup is uh, against 2014, which is a little vengeance match for those first two or three matches I started. Where I kept losing to this fucker. Until I figured it out. So. Yeah, what's he gonna do? Yeah, look at this. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Right, yeah, that. That's basically what he's gonna do. That's how they all. Yeah, basically. This is. That's your standard fucking 2014 tactic. That's your standard fucking tactic. He's gonna. What? Whoa, what's he gonna do? Oh, oh, there you go. Shoot him. Oh, the power! That fucking shot is deadly. That's like one of the main reasons I pick him, besides everything else. Eh, <laughs> denied. There you go. And he's gonna try again. And what's he gonna do? Oh, well, okay, so, yeah. So he's gonna stop him. The second they touch. You touch them, they always fucking do that. It's irritating as a motherfucker. Yep, there you go again. You're gonna do it again. So, what am I gonna do? Yep, yeah, just fucking shoot him. Screw it. Already got the edge. <laughs> yeah, that didn't do anything. Well, at least he's fairly balanced, where his shots are not as strong as certain other characters to make up for the fact that he's really good at melee. So at least there's that. It's not like fucking Biolante where it's just, Oh, well, I'm really good at one primary thing, melee, and I have a massive fucking attack box, whatever the fuck you call it, and you can't do shit. But anyway, back to this fight. Yeah, so he's doing it again, again. And what's he gonna do? He's gonna do that. So, eh, it kind of works, but I just smack him. And he does it again. Not a lot of... A lot of variations getting done here. That's the, and there you go again. Yeah, and then you get fucking thrown. It's like the lead in all the time. And you want to nice try to lead with that. But I ate it on purpose. Didn't have a choice that time. But, and just shoot him. And there you go. Good luck, guy. Uh, a lot of 2014s online, man. He's like, he's the Ken of this game. There's no way around it. He's, he's Ken. <laughs> I like Ken, but you know. Not when other people abuse him. Okay, yeah, this next one. Classic matchup, a little twist. is burning this time around against King Ghidorah. Uh, the thing you have to watch for Ghidorah is that fucking flight. Which my opponent is going to demonstrate a fucking lot. Yeah, he wants to fly. Eh, yeah, yeah, get the fuck down. Ram him, ram him. Good check him! <laughs> Good check him! It's smack. Ah, there you go again. Yeah, he got in. That's his lead in. I don't know. He hasn't just. I don't know if my opponent has discovered that whole triangle jump shit that everybody likes to abuse with him. So I'll give him some credit. At least when he got in, he's trying to fight. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, oh, he has a lot of range. You gotta watch out for that. And he tries to get. No! And he got denied. He got stuffed. The jump attempt got stuffed. Uh, yeah, that oh, shit hurts. You don't wanna be. Close range when that happens. Yeah, give him the roar. Give him the roar! Ah, no, motherfucker. There you go. Bring him down. Yeah, smack him. Yeah. You do it again. No, I'm not gonna let you do that. Get a fucking smack him. There you go. Yeah. Tail whips on the bitch. Let's keep going. Ah, King Ghidorah. Basically, book like Roman Reigns. Loses a fuck ton, but he has to look strong, real strong, even though he's gonna get destroyed. But he always has to look strong, god damn it. Oh well, that's booking for you. Uh, and then he goes again, like, you would think he'd figure this out, that this is not a good idea, but, you know, once to the well, once too often, and we are done here. Ah, oh, spectacular, look at the little explosions. <laughs> when he lands, that really did slow mode a little bit, that was actually really cool. This game's pretty fun. Uh, it's not perfect as a comp, as you know, as a versus title. It has its flaws. Um, a fair amount of them. Game balancing isn't as, you know, isn't that great in certain. They're like, there's too many bad matchups. I would say there's some decent ones, but there are too many like ones that you can clear cut. You know who's stronger most of the time. Maybe someone say, well, that's the way continuity is. But no, I'm sorry, Violence is not the most powerful fucking character in Godzilla verse. So you know, no. That's utter bullshit, but you know, anyway. Yeah, this is the only person I've ever fought to use this Jet Jaguar. Like, I personally love this guy right now. I really do. And no, no homo. I really love this dude right now. Because, like, his name is Chim Chim. That's a complete. That's a Speed Racer reference. And I love me some Speed Racers, so, you know, I gotta. This dude's, like, uber retro right now. I can't help it. I, I enjoy that. I really enjoy that. He actually. Yeah. 
that, that's just Jaguar's like thing. That's his edge. He's a go-behind character. Like, I guess to make him stronger than he would essentially be, they kind of yeah, they kind of use that to pretty much disorient the opponent. Not a bad tactic when I think about it. It's just that drop kick though. It, just, it has so much pause time. Maybe don't do the drop kicks anymore. He's gonna keep doing it. He's gonna keep doing it. So there you go. Ah, there you go. Get a tail. Lead in. The run sounds great in theory for breaking distance, but then the slide is just kind of like, it doesn't stun immediately, and it kind of leaves you open when you do it. So like, I don't know. Yeah, the, the time, yeah, he has a good uh, defensive maneuver with the R2. He'll shrink. Like, this, the ocean is like making this so much more dangerous I can't see him. I mean, I have some idea with the splashes, but he's too close. I couldn't stop him if I wanted to. Maybe just wait for him. There you go, and that's the flaw of that move. Sometimes when you spin, you don't know where the fuck you're going. You'll land sideways and you know get a freebie, but he adjusted fairly well. I'll give him credit. There you go. And a slap! Yeah. Life is not complete without a good tail smack! I missed him. Ah, I botched that horribly. That was smart on his part. Man, yeah, he's drilling me hard. I'm trying to... Yeah, no, that's not good. <laughs> Ah, ah, god damn it. I'm turning around, I'm turning around. When I turn around, the game is over. And there you go. Still, though, very valiant effort. Pretty good fight, interesting. Only person I, that used Jet Jaguar online so far. So, massive credits to Chim Chim. Massive credits. Oh, this is the big one. This is the big one. You know I had to end it on this one. I was ecstatic when I got this fight. You have no fucking idea. Fan dreams coming true. This is a big fucking deal. Godzilla vs. Destroyer. Damn good movie, damn good movie. Probably, you know, I think it's considered one of the best in the 90s Hasten film. You know? like overall, it had everything. It had everything. Even had like a lot of horror movie monster segments with smaller versions of themselves. Really good stuff, but yeah. Destroyer's pretty dangerous when he gets close, though. Even though know, that fucking horn. Yeah, like, dash. I don't even know if I could throw him during that. I'm still flabbergasted. Because I the second his head remotely touches me, it just gets rid of that damn armor. You don't technically have block in this game, it's kind of super armor. You get one or two hits that doesn't move you in most cases, and you know, you do whatever the fuck you want. But then once that goes, you know, you're vote you're prone, and then you know you get knocked around. There you go. Ah, there it goes again. Yeah, it's good at breaking distance. Combo him. Combo him, yeah, it has a little bit of a yeah. Horn. The horn recovery. Crack him with the tail. Let's show some of that movie magic, and we are done. <laughs> Destroyer is destroyed. I think he ended in the same prone position in the movie. That was fucking awesome. All right, well, this is 24. Well, this is the game, and I'll see you guys around. Probably more to come. Bye bye.